हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम अनिरुद्ध अग्रवाल क्लास फाइव स्टूडेंट डेली एंड टुडे वी आर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट मोशन ऑफ द अर्थ वॉट आर द मोशन ऑफ द अर्थ नंबर वन रोटेशन इट इज द मूवमेंट ऑफ द अर्थ ऑन इट्स एक्सिस वॉट आर द मोशन ऑफ द अर्थ नंबर टू रिवोल्यूशन द मूवमेंट ऑफ द अर्थ अराउंड द सन इन अ फिक्सड पाथ और द ऑर्बिट इज कॉल्ड द रिवोल्यूशन वॉट इज ऑर्बिटल प्लेन द प्लेन फॉर्म बाय द ऑर्बिट इज नोन एज ऑर्बिटल प्लेन द एक्सिस ऑफ द अर्थ विच इज एन इमेजिनरी लाइन मेक्स एन एंगल ऑफ सिक्सटी सिक्स एंड हाफ डिग्री विथ इट्स ऑर्बिटल प्लेन What is circle of illumination? Due to the spherical shape of the Earth, only half of it get light from the sun at a time. The portion facing the sun experiences day, while the other half, away from the sun, experiences night. The circle divides the day from night on the globe is called the circle of illumination. The circle of illumination does not coincide with the axis. What is Earth Day? The Earth takes about 24 hours to complete one rotation around its axis. This is the daily rotation of the Earth. This period of rotation is known as the Earth Day. Why February has 29 days? It takes exact 365 days and 6 hours to complete one revolution around the sun. However, we count one year is equal to 365 days only and and ignore 6 hours for sake of convenience. 6 hours saved energy year are added to make one day 24 hours over a span of 4 years. Thus, every 4th year February is of 29 days instead of 28 days. What is leap year? A year with 366 days is called a leap. Manner of revolution. The earth revolves around the sun in an elliptical orbit. Throughout it revolution around the orbit the earth inclined in the same direction types of seasons summer seasons winter seasons spring seasons autumn seasons why there is change in seasons seasons change due to change in the position of the earth around the sun the rays of the sun are at 90 degree on equator 90 degree on tropic of cancer 90 degree on the tropic of capricorn depending on the position of the earth on 21st june the northern hemisphere is tilted towards the sun therefore the sun is at 90 degree at tropic of cancer summer solstice solstice in northern hemisphere winter solstice in southern hemisphere continuous daylight for 6 months continuous night for 6 month effect of summer solstice in northern hemisphere southern hemisphere northern hemisphere receives more heat it is summer in northern hemisphere whereas southern hemisphere receives less less heat it is winter in southern hemisphere the days are longer and nights are shorter in northern hemisphere the days are shorter and nights are longer in southern hemisphere The North Pole experiences continuous daylight for 6 months. 
The South Pole experiences continuous night for six months. What is winter solstice? On 22nd December, the the southern hemisphere is tilted towards the sun. Therefore, the rays of the sun is at 90 degree on Tropic of Capricorn. Continu- continuous night for six month. Continuous day for six month. Winter solstice in northern hemisphere. Summer solstice in southern hemisphere. Effect of winter solstice in su- southern hemisphere, northern hemisphere. Southern Hemisphere receives more heat. It is summer in Southern Hemisphere. Whereas the Northern Hemisphere receives less heat, it is winter in Northern Hemisphere. The days are longer and nights are shorter in Southern Hemisphere. The days are shorter and nights are longer in Northern Hemisphere. The South Pole experiences continuous daylight for 6 months. The North Pole experiences continuous night for 6 months. What is e- what is equinox? On 21st March and on 23rd September, the rays of the sun is at 90 degree at equator. At this position neither of the poles is tilted towards the sun so the whole earth experiences equal day and night this is called equinox effect of equinox month on 23rd september uh, northern hemisphere autumn season southern hemisphere spring season On 21st March, Northern Hemisphere spring season, Southern Hemisphere autumn season.